Welcome back to Kids Fun Science. My name's Ken. Today's experiment is the hand boiler. As always, adult supervision is required. What you need for this experiment is the hand boiler. And you can see this description where I got mine. So before we do the experiment, I want to show you that it actually comes in four different colors. I don't have blue. Well, I actually did and it broke. Um, but I have purple, green, and red. And I use this at my science night uh, for the kids. Uh, so they do break every once in a while. They are delicate. Uh, but overall, I've had uh, only broken a couple over the years with 300 kids at a science night. So you got different designs and different colors, and you can order what you want. The procedure is basically just grabbing the hand boiler and putting it in your palm without tightly grabbing it. Just put it in your palm. You don't have to squeeze it, and it will start. The liquid will start going up to the top. And uh, not everybody, but most people, it will, uh, hence the name boiler, start to look like it's boiling, just like that. So um, it's pretty cool, and I'll do the other two colors, and I will explain the science behind it. As you can see, to get the liquid to the bottom, you just grab the top of the boiler, and the liquid will go down to the bottom, as gravity is not going to help you. Uh, to explain the science behind this, the heat from your hand transfers the liquid from the bottom of the boiler. This increases the temperature, causing the pressure inside the bulb to rise. As a result, the liquid moves to the top of the hand boiler bulb. After almost all the liquid is moved from the bottom to the top of the boiler, the remaining liquid starts to move up the tube to the top and it creates bubbles in the liquid at the top to appear like it's boiling, hence the name hand boiler. When containers are kept closed like the hand boilers, an interesting relationship exists between the temperature and pressure. The more temperature increases, the more pressure increases. Molecules of gas inside the container move faster as temperature rises and pressure increases. Over the years owning these hand boilers, I always found it interesting to see different people um, who can make it boil and who can't. Temperatures of people aren't exactly all the same. So some people are hotter than others. So I've seen some people barely get the liquid up and others to be like myself that make it boil every time. So I uh, hope you enjoyed this video. Remember to like and subscribe. You can look in the description where I got my hand boilers. And thanks for watching.